Do we really need a new Mario Kart game? Mario Kart 9? No. Before you go flaming me in the comment section. Typey, typey, typey. Why? We need Mario Kart 9. Hold up. I really do enjoy Mario Kart 8. And Mario Kart 9 will probably make it better. But the reason why we don't need Mario Kart 9 right now is because what in the world are they going to be doing? What are they going to do? Mario Kart 9, or Mario Kart 8 is already a fantastic game. They took everything from every other game, slapped it into one of them, repackaged it, and called it a day. The game's great. They even brought out DLC. They pretty much gave you a game for 50% off, and it's amazing. The game is great, okay? I have strong opinions about Mario Kart 8, and now... What are they going to do if the Nintendo Switch 2 comes out and what are they going to do? Put a, put a double dash down car and call it a day? No, they got to make something unique. What is it going to be unique and also going to fit the formula of online racing? Because I know that there's a lot of people out there, maybe you watching this video, like to play Mario Kart 8 online and yeah, do little challenges or mini games or just try your hardest or whatever the case may be. Uh, I think that those people like Mario Kart 8 because it's nice and balanced. The one thing that I will say that Mario Kart 8 kind of they've got to go is skill balancing and games and little tuning in your character. Like, why can't you use the character that you want to use? Instead of it having a special skill and boom, you can't use the character because you have a disadvantage at that point because your character is too heavy or your character is too light or it doesn't have enough acceleration. Like, what in the world, Nintendo? You could do that for the cars. That's fine. But don't do it for the characters because then you can't use the character that you want. Yes, I know that Yoshi, Yoshi, Yoshi Bear, Yoshi Bear is probably the best one. But besides that, that you can't use Link because, oh no, he's too heavy. Or you can't use Bowser. Oh no, he's too heavy, but his speed's good. He can't accelerate fast enough. Like, what in the world? It's it's mind-boggling that that was a decision to be had. Because now, if you go to an online race, at least 50% of the lobby is going to have a Yoshi Bear. and Or Yoshi Teddy. Whatever. So, hopefully they get rid of that in Mario Kart 9. If that's gonna be a thing but besides that we don't need it because what are, we, what are they gonna do oh i've been on a rant oh. okay so if we do need mario kart 9 which we don't because nintendo can make sure to welly optimize and make a great game <clears throat> Super Mario 3D Odyssey, whatever. Um, yeah, I, I want that because Mario 3D Od Odyssey was a great game, but to be fair, we haven't seen one since 2017. So that's kind of a bummer, don't you agree? Yeah, it, it's a bummer. But anyways, those games are great. Maybe a Zelda game, they're probably not going to make another one, but Mario Kart is a game that you could probably play over and over again, because it's kind of competitive in a way. So, in a way, people probably have over 5,000 hours of Mario Kart, and that's perfectly fine. The game's 10 years old, though, that's where the problem comes. We're not going to, Nintendo's hopefully not going to throw a curveball and make like a GTA kind of thing. That the game came out in 2013 and oh, we're still going with it. Actually, basically, it is kind of like that. But besides that point, um, yeah, nothing has been announced. Maybe Nintendo actually doesn't even know what they're doing with Mario Kart. Because Mario Kart 8 is a perfectly fine game and what... In the world are they gonna be doing besides adding funky items and a different spin on things maybe enhanced graphics or enhanced game design or UI or something but like I honestly think that I can stick for a couple more years with Mario Kart 8 because 
it's a fun game. If you don't like Mario Kart, go play Mario Kart Wii or something. Mario Kart Wii is actually a fantastic game. I love Mario Kart Wii. Just to the classic music and uh, the awesome Wii mechanics. Like, <sighs> the Wii was just a great area of, era of Mario Kart. That's probably your first Mario Kart game. Unless you're the one who used the DS, 3DS. Or maybe you played on the original Mario Kart of the SNES. Who knows? But tell me what your favorite Mario Kart is in the comment section. Is it Mario Kart 8 Deluxe? Mario Kart 8, well, they're technically the same game. I'm gonna leave it as that. Um, Mario Kart Double Dash, Mario Kart Wii, and uh, NES Super Mario Kart. Yeah, so leave me a comment down below. And, uh, Maybe do you agree with me that we don't need Mario Kart 9 because what are they going to do? And also, we got a fine game. The game came out with DLC from all the other courses. Every other courses. Like, are they? Yeah, let's be honest here. If they make Mario Kart 9, what do you think is going to happen? For me, I think that they're going to take maybe... 24 tracks, alright? 24 tracks, slap a package on them. So, let's just say 50% of these tracks are from Mario Kart 8 or the game's prior. Actually, 70% of these tracks are probably from the game's prior. And then, maybe they'll make 30% brand new tracks. Then they're gonna slap a big label on it, sell it for $90 with the new Nintendo system. But even though you could already play those games on Mario Kart 8, or those maps on Mario Kart 8, maybe you want to try the new mechanic. Ooh, what's gonna be the new mechanic? <laughs> to make it fair and balanced. Remember Nintendo, we need something fair and balanced for like online play, because that's probably where the cake why Mario Kart is still alive today. That's probably why the online or just a fun party game. Yes, but if you're actually gonna make Mario Kart 9, make sure that you get rid of the horrible selection thing, your stats on the character. That shouldn't matter as much as it does. The cars is a cool concept, but the characters if you wanted to play competitive, you can't be the character that you like. That's just mind-boggling to me. So hopefully Nintendo fixes that, if that's going to come out. But to be honest, we don't need it because we got a perfectly fine game right now. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Game that came out in 2014. Got revamped for the Switch. It sold as a, another game for 2017. And then got DLC in 2022, I think. Pretty sure. Yeah, probably 21. Anyways, besides that, I think Mario Kart is a good game. Hopefully they can work on some other game because we don't need it right now. Trust me, we don't need it. If you're still going to flame me in the comment sections, go right ahead. Flame me. That's perfectly fine. You can say what you don't like and what you do like. And, and uh, yeah, I'll make sure to answer to those. Unless it's a very not nice flamed, uh, like, if I got destroyed, you win. You win. But if you want to be on my side for once, um, go ahead. Leave me a nice comment. A very nice comment of how you feel about Mario Kart 8 and Mario Kart 9 situation. Because, <clears throat> oh boy, there is so many different channels out there that... The number one thing for them is Mario Kart 9. But, like, why? We got a good game on the Switch. Mario Kart 8, even though it's 10 years old, it doesn't feel 10 years old because they just recently got out DLC. And now it's this is the biggest Mario game that we've got so far 48 tracks in one game. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. Woo! Sorry about that. But, yeah. Nice calm voices. I think that it would be cool to see maybe something, whatever's on in the future, but we don't need it now. 
So, yeah, if you agree with me, consider dropping a like. Maybe be sub sub subscribing, you know, subscribing. Yep, 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 yep. And if you don't agree with me, maybe drop a like. Maybe subscribing. Don't, you know, I don't, I don't care. Just drop a comment say, comment down below so I know how you feel about this strange situation that I brought up. I'm probably going to get grilled, but that's fine by me. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.